A woman named Dania DeLuca did not understand her dog's love. For her kids well enough. Until she entered her daughter's room to find an awkward sight. The dog behaved strangely toward the baby. And the reason shocked thousands of people. Dania DeLuca had always loved dogs since childhood. Her parents had bought her one when she was a toddler. And she felt bad whenever her pet was ill or injured. She built an unbreakable bond with every puppy her dad bought for her. And as soon as she became a mom. She taught her children how to best interact with dogs. She wanted them to have the same happy childhood. She had had and knew that their lives wouldn't be complete. Without a pet in the house. Her passion motivated her to adopt a pup from. Heidi's Legacy Dog Rescue in Tampa. Florida. The dog was an amazing addition to her family. And stayed with them for 13 beautiful years. Before crossing the Rainbow Bridge. Molly, her 7-year-old daughter. And Joey, her 4-year-old son were devastated when their best friend passed away from old age. Dania and her husband, Adam, took a little time to grieve the dog, and immediately decided to get another pet. They initially planned to get another kind of animal, like a cat or a rabbit, but then decided to go for another dog. By now, they were used to having a pet that needed pets, and long walks in the park, and weren't ready to change their habits to accommodate another species with different necessities. So Dania went back to the shelter and started browsing. A two-year-old German Shepherd had been rescued by the facility some months earlier. The dog had undergone maltreatment and some traumatizing conditions that nearly killed him. However, staying in the shelter meant that the canine would be rehabilitated and trained to coexist peacefully with humans and other pets. Many visitors to the facility had boycotted the dog for fear that it was too dangerous to be a pet. But the animal's dark past did not deter Dania from adopting him. He was beautiful and calm when she saw him, and she thought he was perfect for her family. Her husband, Adam, though, thought she was crazy to adopt a traumatized dog. He feared that it would hurt his kids and make them regret it. It was difficult to accept that the animal had undergone rehabilitation and they had nothing to fear. Adam had heard stories of pet dogs hurting children when adults were not around to monitor them and he didn't want it to happen to his family. The pair discussed the idea extensively and decided to put the adoption on hold for a while. However, after weeks without an animal at home, the family realized they couldn't cope anymore. This time, they all went to the shelter together, and Dania had the chance to introduce House to the rest of her family. Later, DeLuca even added that House looked like her. She noted that some of his features, like his eyes, were similar to hers. This was obviously not true. But she was desperate to convince everyone that he was the ideal fit for her family. Her words convinced Adam. And House found his forever home. Days after entering the house for the first time, he won everybody's hearts. Molly and Joey loved the dog and always played with him. Even the neighbors cared for him. Because he was kind to them too. House soon began living up to the meaning of his name. He would accommodate everyone that visited. And when he strolled to the neighbor's compound, they would accept him with open arms. He soon became a household celebrity, with friends visiting the apartment just to see House. At night, he looked out for the kids without them even knowing. He would follow them around and watch the environment to ensure they were in good hands. He played with them in the pool during the day and preferred to eat with them. Their bond was deep and strong. And both Dania and Adam were now convinced that adopting the German Shepherd had been a great idea. A few weeks after House settled in, though, he developed a strange habit. He would spend hours in the backyard, walking aimlessly as though he had lost an expensive item. 
Dania noticed his actions but shrugged them off. It was his home too, so he was permitted to do anything. This strange behavior only lasted a couple of days before getting worse. One day, House started following the kids. Around wherever they went. Refusing to grant them even the privacy they needed in the bathroom. And would bark at the slightest provocation from the adults. That afternoon, the pet dog who had grown into a protector. Became aggressive around Molly's room. And started rejecting Dania's attention. He used to stop whatever he was doing. Whenever he saw her and instantly land on his back for pets. This time, things were different. He wished he could talk and tell her to stay away. But he couldn't. She remained clueless about the danger and started fearing. That the dog might hurt her child. While she trusted House around her kids and. Had no reason to doubt his loyalty. Things were different now. And she wished she knew why. Molly and her grandmother had been out all day. And were both tired. They had their bath and settled for dinner before going to bed. Where they shared one last cookie before turning off the lights. Apparently, they left food crumbs on the floor. But deferred the cleaning to the next morning. As they tried to sleep, House started barking uncontrollably. Molly was unmoved. Thinking it was the usual tactic he would use whenever he was lonely. However, Grandma read his behavior as a warning but didn't know what to watch out for. She turned on the lights and called out for Dania. Asking her to help find the cause of the dog's restlessness. The two women probed the room. Hoping to find the possible provocation. But saw nothing. Then they got to the far corner and. Tried to look behind the large wooden wardrobe. But that's when House barked even more loudly and jumped forward. Forcing them to retreat. Before they could realize what was happening. House was unconscious and gasping for breath. His aggression reduced, and weakness took over. After a few seconds, he lost his strength and collapsed. Dania was scared and drew closer to her pet dog to examine it. Only then did she realize that. Something had motivated his actions throughout the day. On his body, she found three large snake bites on his front leg and immediately recognized the aggressor, a rattlesnake. Rattlesnakes will happily bite their victim more than once. Especially if they are within reach. She ran to the kitchen and asked that her kids and mother leave the room. She came back with a big chopping knife and. When she found the intruder innocently coiled under the bed. She struck with purpose. A rattlesnake's venom damages tissue and affects the circulatory system. It also destroys the skin and blood cells by causing internal hemorrhage. It takes a few seconds to travel across the victim's body. And that's why House had collapsed immediately. When not treated immediately. The bite results in organ damage or death. Experts advise that victims receive emergency care no later than. 30 minutes after the bite. Dania was scared for her dog's health and phoned emergency services. Luckily, they arrived minutes later and took the hero dog to the vet to take care of it. The snake had injected large volumes of deadly venom into House's system, thus giving him little chance of survival. Thankfully, House got to the hospital in Tampa early enough for him to be revived. He was given several vials of anti-venom per day for five days, and then he had to spend some time in the ICU. To the amazement of doctors, House recovered fast. Neighbors who heard what he did took to social media to share the news. Social media users showed support for the animal. Through words of encouragement and financial assistance. In fact, they opened a GoFundMe page titled Help Save House. Where they raised over $52,000 against their goal of $28,000. Animal lovers globally sent in words of encouragement to Dania and her family while wishing the dog a speedy recovery. The show of love gladdened Dania, who said, I have people from Sweden, and I don't even know anyone in Sweden, reaching out and donating. It's crazy. 
In due time, House returned to Molly and Joey. His favorite humans, and continued being their loyal guardian angel. So now it's your turn. Tell us about any hero dog you've seen or heard about. Every day, the dog takes the bus alone. It lies alone on the bus and stares at the passengers coming and going. People are very surprised by the dog's behavior. Until they understand the truth of the matter. Everyone is moved to tears by the dog. What happened? Why does this dog take the bus alone every day? Everything in the world has spirits. And animals also have feelings. Although we can't understand their language. Their actions give us a new understanding of animals. As we all know, dogs are good friends of human beings. And they have gradually become a part of many people's lives. We often see many warm stories between owners and dogs. These stories not only move us. But also let everyone know the loyalty of dogs. Today, let's look at a very warm story that happened to dogs. The story takes place in an area of England. Where it is common for owners and dogs to ride on buses. And other public transport. There is no need to put up a notice allowing dogs to get on the bus. Because people have already acquiesced in this rule. However, a rare thing happened on a bus driving here. There is a dog who doesn't ride with his owner. He rides a bus alone every day. After getting on the bus. The dog seems to be very sensible. He knows that some humans are afraid of dogs. So he keeps his distance consciously. However, during this period. He keeps looking at all the passengers. Which attracts many people's surprise and curiosity. On this day, the dog got on the bus from the bus stop as usual. And a new passenger on the bus was startled by the dog. The dog wore a red collar with a golden sash around his neck. But there was no owner around him. The driver seemed to be used to the lonely dog. And closed the door with good advice and went on to the next stop. When the dog patrolled the passengers on the bus. He would find the open space near the back door and lie down. Then the passengers poured him some water to drink. And the dog finished drinking the water in three or two times. Every time you stop at a stop. The dog will stare at the passengers nervously. As the passengers get off the bus one by one. They all say goodbye to the clever dog. After the dog looks at fewer and fewer passengers. It begins to feel uneasy. Dogs once wanted to get off the bus halfway. But because the bus stop is the main road and traffic is frequent. Passengers think it will be dangerous if the dog is pulled away. So they ask the dog to stay at the bus stop first. The poor dog took the bus for about 20 minutes. And then got off with a passenger at a highway entrance and exit. People wondered that maybe the dog always took the bus with his owner. And knew he had to get off here. The driver will explain to passengers every time that the dog last saw his owner on this bus. And he will take this bus every day to find his owner. One of the passengers, Jay, was impressed by the lonely appearance of the dog sitting in the front seat and took a photo and posted it on his social media because he felt that if the submission could be seen by the owner, he could see the dog again. The passengers' posts on social media spread, and the media interviewed them. When they got to the bus, they found that the dog had been sitting quietly. With a sad look on his face. Every time a new passenger came up, he would smell it. Probably hoping to see his owner again. Despite a growing number of calls on social media. The dog's owner did not show up. After that, the dog was adopted by the staff of the Animal Rescue Center. They named him Hardy. And they wanted to confirm whether the owner of the dog was still alive. However, because there was no news of the owner. The dog had to be transferred to a nearby shelter. The staff began to find a new owner for him. They all hoped to find a family that really needed him for Hardy. So they carefully screened these applications. This matter has been widely spread not only on social media, but also on the news. 
Many people have asked the shelter to adopt Hardy. Many people speculate that Hardy may have been abandoned by his original owner, or his owner may have left the world because of illness or accident. But more people sincerely hope that Hardy will meet a new owner and get happiness in the future. Perhaps true love is not just like, or wait. This kind of feeling is even more precious between animals and human beings. Human feelings are sincere. And animal feelings are never mixed with half falsehood. Which is worth thinking about whether we treat small animals as true love. And most of the time. The feelings between people are conveyed by words. While most animals rely on actions. And their own behaviors to convey their feelings. This kind of behavior is often more touching. Here is an equally warm and touching story. I wonder if you have never seen a cat who can take a bus. In Britain, there is a very persistent cat. He gets on the bus at about 10 o'clock every day. The driver is very familiar with him and doesn't stop him from getting on the bus because he is very good and never makes trouble. Sometimes the driver comes early and waits for the cat specially. After getting on the bus, the cat will sit quietly by the window. The whole journey of the bus is 17.5 kilometers. It will get off at the end every time. And then take the bus back in the evening. So as to live on time like office workers. The cat has lived on time for five years. During these five years, it can't take this bus every day. Many new passengers are surprised by the cat's behavior. Because they have never seen their own cat on the bus. At this time, the kind driver will tell them the cat's story. And people who have heard the cat's story are all moved by its loyal spirit. It turns out that this cat is called Casper. Five years ago, it lost with its owner. The owner used to take the number three bus with the cat. The clever Casper remembered the bus route only once. The last time he met in Casper's memory was when he took this bus with his owner. Casper probably thought that by taking the bus repeatedly or going to the terminal, he could bring his master back to his side. The driver is very distressed by this sensible kitten. And the familiar passengers like it very much, and they often feed it. When he sits in the car, he looks around from time to time, as if afraid of missing the familiar face. After getting off the bus, its figure disappeared from people's sight, and at night, it would board the bus again. Now Casper is 13 years old, which is equivalent to 70 years old of human beings. He is inflexible in walking and has a poor memory. When he is old, he sometimes forgets where to get off. But he never gives up taking the bus every morning. Sometimes the cat even forgets where to get off. The kind driver will remind him that the passengers are waiting for him patiently. People in the neighborhood gradually got to know this loyal kitten. And after hearing its story, they were moved by its behavior. Feelings of small animals are always clean and pure. And a cat's life is really short, but it is only a few decades. The cat in the story spent five years commuting to and from the bus every day. Just to let the owner come back to him. I believe many people will think that in real life. People may not be able to achieve this level. They foolishly insist on waiting for their master's behavior. This most sincere feeling makes countless people extremely moved.